is like a kid in a candy store right now. It's Thursday evening and we are about to go to a new gym. Well, kind of new. I guess it's not really new. We're but going back to an old gym that was really fun. We're going back to a gym. Have you seen my um, Lululemon socks that come up high? Oh. <sighs> Can't I find don't. Them. Can't find them anywhere. But we're going to go. We haven't been to this gym in a couple of years. Yeah. But it was really fun whenever we, whenever we were going there. And we are just kind of getting tired of going to Hot Works. Yeah, I mean, it was kind again. of like the same thing over and over again, which... Yeah. It'd be cool if you could have a Hot Works membership and a, like, regular gym membership, but we're... Well, that's just, what we're going to do. We're, we're too cheap. We don't want to have both. No, I'm keeping my... We're going to keep both of them. Oh, I might cancel mine. I don't know. Yeah, but so it's what, worth... But I'm saying it's worth the money to have hmm. both, um, like, options, you know? Yeah. But we're going to go try that new gym out today. And then Blake's going to meet a friend tonight. It's a lot different than what it used to be. Whenever I went when I was a kid, it was like, it had different ownership and stuff, and now they've changed it a little bit. So what's your plan at the gym? Well, we're gonna do some chest today and some okay, tricep. Okay, so I'm used to being like told- Play some basketball? At, no, I'm not playing basketball. Well, I'm gonna play some basketball. At Hot Works, I'm used to being told like, cause in the cycle you have a virtual instructor, right? So they're telling you, Okay, increase your speed, increase your intensity, whatever. I, like, I'm going to have to go back to working out by myself, being, like, disciplined, and and I don't know. Like, how am I going to do that? What do you mean, how are you going to do that? You'll, you'll I'm just going to have to find, like, a, a rhythm, and... You'll get it. Like, am I going to run on the treadmill? What do I, what do I want to cool do? That's the thing. You have freedom now. You have free will. And now I'm kind of, like, anxious thinking oh about... My. This is a good social experiment to see if people... How they react after having strict rules, and then now you have free. Will I feel like I'm a person that needs to be told, okay, here's what you do, and here's your intensity. That's why I like <laughs> Hot Works. Well, do you want me to just be on the phone with you while you're on your AirPods and just say, "Lift harder, go faster." No, I Slow mean, if you had now. like an actual like plan, then I would like that. Okay. Anyway, we'll we'll show you what the gym. Funny story, my dad actually um, did the, the ceiling of the gym. It's like this faux wood paneling, and he used to have a commercial design company, and his company did um, the really cool ceiling. I'll show you when we get there. What's in your gym bag? What? You have shoes on. tripod to like prop my phone up so bear with me i am about to meet my friend quincy for i think we're getting drinks but i'm honestly starving so i'm gonna get dinner and my sweatshirt is still so sweaty i'm like still sticky so i brought just a different jacket and some perfume and we're just gonna roll with it anyway um i'm about to head in it's pouring rain bryce is on his own for dinner tonight so we took separate cars to the gym and that's about it just gonna do a little spritz of perfume cover up any sweat smell oh my gosh i'm probably so gross all right heading in Q and I both got burgers. I've never had a gluten and dairy. I'm so excited. Gluten and dairy. <laughs> I just realized. We're gonna be sick tonight, bitch. Hey, listen, <laughs> you're getting it all. I got my wine. Bitch, I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. 
back and you're done. And you just do a cute little bun, you know? So tonight we're going to the gym, getting a workout in, even though I just ate. I literally just finished eating like an hour ago. I'm definitely not gonna have a good time if I do any cardio. We like our new gym membership. We went for the first time yesterday where I stayed for like two hours. I left early. Time flies whenever you're doing stuff that you like. Because I went and lifted weights and then ran. And then I went and played basketball for like an hour. Mm -hmm. But I feel like you could do that with, you could go play tennis for an hour, you could go swim. Yeah, I'm excited about the tennis. You could go play volleyball. We, we, need, need, to, we need to take Ruby to play volleyball. We need to get a volleyball and go up there. Mm -hmm. But we're excited. We're going to, like, um, I don't know, utilize all the resources they have. They have, like, a CrossFit area. They have a track around the basketball arena. They have an outdoor track, too, right? They have an outdoor running path. Um, and the pool's heated year round. The pool is heated year round. But the crazy and it has thing is, lap, it has like a lap pool. You would think it's like some crazy expensive, like bougie gym, but it's, it's like a, it's 140 super affordable. a month for both of us. Yeah, like it's, I feel like that's the same price as like Lifetime or. It's a, yeah, I mean, and it's totally, and it's, not it's as way good. better. It's a different crowd. Like at Lifetime, there's a bunch of young kids that are all like walking right, around in tank messing tops. Around. Yeah, like messing around. Bunch of TikTokers, as I call them, where this is like mostly older people that just want like a quiet, nice place to work out. Yeah, so and the relaxing. locker rooms are so clean. Yeah, they, Every, everything's clean. They are so nice. This sounds like an ad, but like it's just that nice that the locker rooms each, like the women's and the men's, have a hot tub, sauna, steam room, showers really really nice lockers and then like a whole area to get ready like hair dryers lotions hair sprays um they have daycare too don't they they have like a child yeah. care Lots that of we, we used to put ruby in it when i was I little bet. they also have like a spa so you can go get yes they um, have a spa and we have a free 60 minute massage yeah. that was the first um like spa i ever went to my stepmom took me uh, I don't remember how old I was, like 10 or 11. We've been members here forever. But um, my dad canceled his membership like two years ago because, um, I don't know, he moved or something. Anyway, um, it was the first like spa I went to and we got like manicure, pedicure. Um, I think she got a massage. We got in, like the hot tub. And they do all the classes, like Zoom, I don't know, like yoga, Pilates. Cycle, cycle yoga, Pilates, free, Zumba. Aerial yoga, which we got a free one of those too. That's where you like fly around in the air while you while you do your yoga. <laughs> I'm definitely doing that one. Yeah. We just got home from our workout and it's like I think it's like 7:30 or 8. And I could not resist just putting on the comfiest outfit. Basically, I've been in pajamas like all day. Um pink t-shirt, comfy LNA sweatpants, and we're about to make some dinner. Mm -hmm. Fresh hair. Oh, yeah. Anyway, we're gonna make some lunch. Are you making leftovers? What's up? Yep, making some leftovers. And we're gonna take the dogs on the W A L K. Can't say the out. word because Tyson's gonna go. Don't you worry about a thing. Let's 
listen, the trick is to let the sugar kind of just land on the bacon. Mm, just let it land, baby. Let it land, let it land. And then you, um, let it land. But let listen, it land. that way you can put your spoon back into the bag because you can touch any raw meat. Ooh. And then later you go and you pat it in. Mm. You know what I mean? Shit. You know what I mean, baby? Some kind of Okay, well, I seem to have somehow burnt this entire pan. I don't really understand how that's possible, but the bacon is done and it looks phenomenal. Now we gotta ice these bad boys. I'm just gonna do, I've never had these Trader Joe's cinnamon rolls. Ooh, I don't know if I should have done, maybe, yeah, let's do circles. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, circles. It's getting a little wild, but you know what? That's okay. Bam. Well, the flyaways are real. Look at that. Every time I wash my hair, I get really bad flyaways the, the day of. So um, we're gonna go walk around downtown Frisco, maybe grab a coffee. The doggies have never walked around down there. Honestly, we haven't either, now that I think about it. Um, it's just kind of a cute little area. Kona, that's enough. <laughs> We're probably gonna be gone for a while tonight. We're gonna go down to Dallas with some friends. So I'm trying to get the dogs like, we need to take them somewhere where they can run. Maybe we should come back to this field. No, they're okay. They'll get a nice good Tyson says, no, I wanna run. I wanna run. <laughs> Look how cute he looks. He's happy. Blake's just getting some good photos well, with the dogs. we took a cute photo with the doggies. You guys liked it, huh? Yeah. Oh, look at that. Your phone's way better than mine. So I ordered the most high maintenance drink. I get it every time, but usually what I do is I order it on the app. That way all I have to do is like press the plus button and it's that's all I have to do. But at the drive through speaker or like if you go inside, you have to tell them Grande, light ice, splash of coconut milk, splash of cinnamon dulce. Like, it's the longest order I've ever heard, and it makes me feel. You're self conscious about your. I Starbucks am. Order. It makes me feel like annoyingly high maintenance, which I know it is, but no. it's easier there to just. There are people that come through here and they buy like four coffees that are all custom made. It's not. But. High if you. Um... Our camera's gonna fall. If you want to try this drink, it is Chef's Kiss phenomenal chef's best kiss. drink. It might be backwards chef's on here. I'll put up like a picture kiss. of it. It's phenomenal. All right, we gotta pay though. Oh, we gotta pay. Thank you. Can we, can we have a puppuccino as well? Thank you. He's probably like fuck these people. Okay, we have to take turns. Okay, it's Tyson's turn. You probably ate the whole cup, Kona. No, Tyson. <laughs> oh my. Oh my, Tyson. Kona, get out of okay, Bryce is watching um, the show called The Serpent out in the living room. It's such a good show. I actually stayed up like all night watching it um so now he's catching up on it but if it is loud that is what it is so i am going to quickly get ready we have to leave in like 30 minutes so i was going to use curlers but to me this works a little bit better if you just so I start with the back of my hair i'm going for like a 90s like blowout right so nothing too crazy and i just grab this is like a one and a half inch barrel honestly the bigger the better but this is what i found works really well for me and you twist your hair up and depending on like how bouncy you want your hair the longer you'll hold the curl so you'll let go of that roll and keep in mind i'm well let me just show you in the second one 
I flipped it upward. So I want my curls to flip out. And then I'm just going to get all this hair out of the way. And while it's still hot, I'm going to pin it to my head with a little clip, just like that. And keep in mind, it does get messy, but like I said, there's no really like perfect way to do this. I mean, maybe there is, but that's not my thing. And I'm trying to go quick. So I'm just gonna tie this part up because it's kind of in my way at the moment and then do these two sections as well. So I grab the curling iron and I have it clamp side down so that it's flipped up and then get that hair all the way to the bottom and just roll upward. Hold for like maybe 10, 15 seconds. I know that sounds like a long time, but I also don't have the heat all the way up. Okay, and then I will roll this back up. This does burn your fingers like a tiny bit. And clip it. Now for the top half, I'm going to essentially do the same thing on the back few pieces and then the front few pieces I'm going to curl under, like with the clamp above. But for these, clamp goes down still and we do the same thing. Okay, now for these front two pieces, instead of going out, I'm going to go this way where it's kind of underneath, but also kind of pointed out, if that makes sense. I don't know, just at this like 90, degree angle. Oh, okay, let's take these down. I'm kind of scared, honestly. Curly, curly, curly. And if need be, you can always take a straightener to them, you know, kind of get them a little less, <laughs> a little less wavy and blown out. Woo! We're gonna take a straightener to that. Oh, baby. All right. Brush them out. Oh, yes. The blowout. <laughs> hey, they look good, not gonna lie. If I slept on this, they would look perfect tomorrow, but we're gonna definitely take a straightener to that. Okay. So I was like, what? Okay. Oh, that's smart. Okay, we're we're like a walking Zara ad. We're all wearing the Zara jeans. White, black, <laughs> denim, regular. Quincy's feeling it. So where's, what's the deal with the Lakeshore? This is Quincy's boyfriend, Jack. Give us a wave. <laughs> This is my friend Henry's company. It's called Lakeshore. Love it. Uh, it's oh. a kind of fishing outdoors company. Mm -hmm. Oklahoma and based. It's got Oklahoma. He's from Oklahoma and he lives in Houston, so they got Oklahoma and Texas stuff. Woo! Right, you should check it out. It's awesome. <laughs> is the back just black? It's oh, champion! champion. Yeah. Well, yeah, yeah. Love it. Oh yeah. Okay. Ride your way. Ride your way. That's right, bitches. Ride that way. <laughs> we just sold out all the floors. Cheers, bitch. <laughs> We're at this bar called HD, and we love it here because it's like a rooftop bar. I think you can see the skyline, can't you? We'll have to go over there. But we got the first perfect substance. We got the perfect table because it's kind of cold out. It's like the only table with a fire, right? What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, this is like Inception, but for phones. It's chilly. That view, though. I wish it were like sunset. All right, well, we're off to Javier's. We're going to finally eat some dinner. I know, I do. Oh, 
Okay, so we got the Padrone 1964 series, uh, nice light smoke, uh, complemented with this Victoria, a little known Mexican beer that's pretty good. If you like Dos Equis or anything like that, you definitely need to try it. <laughs> I am not funding this, but I do think it's sexy. It's sexy. Quincy's Cuban, Cuban Poppy. Poppy. Oh, here we go. Oh, oh. <laughs> Can't talk right now, I'm doing hot girl shit. <laughs> This is terrifying. Okay, we have this competition. Yeah, you gotta explain it. Where? Vomit, but it'll make you really Quincy! No, we're not vomiting tonight. We Quincy have this, won't even get through two sips. We have this idea, right? Jack's a little bit more than mine. You can dump some of yours in mine. We have this idea where we, the girls all, are all in agreement that with a straw you can drink way more and way faster. But and ladies, ladies, it doesn't stain your teeth. And oh. yes, and your teeth will stay white, right? right? Stupid ass yeah. boys. The boys about to come out on top on this one. They think that you can just gulp it down. <laughs> You're participating. Oh, shit. Okay. Oh. You know what? Okay. Three, two, one, go. I'm so scared. I'm just scared. <laughs> <laughs> like, room dog. I did, I did. I, got I, I need to be a little less aggressive. It's Javier's favorite for a reason. It's the best friend. It's Javier's favorite because I'm going to have to leave here. I'm going to leave here in an AMP. He's drinking. Don't listen to him. I always recommend it. Top shelf, the regular, no the regular. This one is safe. Top shelf. Okay, I'll take that one. You know, regular is. It was okay. Hey, hey, give me, give me the top shelf. It was shelf. okay, but top shelf will be better. Okay, hold on, no. one top. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> hold on. Hold on. Honey, honey, I got it. Oh, he knows that. You know, I, I like to prove. You know, I bring you, I bring the regular and the top shelf. That's the okay. way you do it. Okay. Jack, Jack, thank you. Schoolgirl with a bad grade. Addison Ray? She's underage. No, she's not. She's almost 25. She's 22. Wait, 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 wait. Out of the fucking vlog. You want to vlog? I'm vlogging. Vlog. Hey, hey, hey. 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 Hey, h
pretty cool. They had a tiramisu cake that I was like, fuck, if it were my birthday, that's what we'd be getting. <laughs> tiramisu cake. But um, we're going to go to my sister's volleyball game. Go then to them go every weekend. To your dad's, maybe. I don't know what we're doing out there today. I think yeah, they said we're going to play volleyball, but how are we going to do that? Well, we're going to be in the pool? No, I'm not. We're yeah, not it's way too cold to get in the pool. We're going to grill tonight, hang out. And then maybe go home later tonight. What are we gonna do tonight? Do we have any shows that we're watching? Oh yeah, what, what's that show? We're, we're watching, watching The Serpent. The Serpent. It's pretty good. It is pretty good. Well, I'm almost done. You need to you need to catch up. Yeah. Me and Blake are pretty good about watching like the same episode. Like if she falls asleep, I'll turn it off. But the other night, I fell asleep kind of early, and okay. Blake kept watching because I think she's editing a video or something. I was so intrigued. And she watched like four put it episodes. Away. So I, I need to catch up. I couldn't, I just couldn't turn it off. It was so good. I use all of it. All right, what are we doing, Blakey? So we're making Angie a charcuterie board, my stepmom for her birthday. Um, and I saw this thing on TikTok where you take like salami or pepperoni or whatever meat you want for your cheese board, and you wrap mm -hmm. it around a wine glass a bunch, and it creates like a rose effect. Meat rose. A meat rose. That's so weird. Mm -mm. Okay, so I'm just gonna let this sit here. Let it mold. While and then we'll I come finish. back to it. Yeah, I gotta yeah. finish everything first. Okay, let's see what we got. We did some pecans that are yeah they're candied, so those should be pretty tasty. And then some some salami, a couple different types of cheeses that we got from Sprouts, and then we got some chocolate covered almonds. That's red pepper jelly to go with the cream cheese. Got a couple more cheeses, strawberry and, cheese. strawberry. and then we also got a little cake too, so. Yeah, should be good. Yeah, should be fun. Yeah, I think it's more about the name now than it is. I mean, I think there's better wines out there. Cheers. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Cheers, love you. That's good. Oh, here we go. Oh my God, it's That's really cold. Good. How come you're putting these in? Just for a photo op. Oh, a spider came out of here. Blake, look. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Why would you do that? That thing came so close to me. weekly giveaways to new subscribers so if you're watching this subscribe like this video get a thumbs up I don't know what all the youtubers have to say but help us out and we will pick winners every week to give a Starbucks gift card to so 